Hey guys, this is Ravensleaf45 and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV and Walker, the Arden Custom Delivery Service. So last time, or rather last week when I'm doing this, we were helping this weird little plant creature to find out who he really is. So at first I thought he'd be a human, but after doing the first couple of deliveries, he turned into a human with a head of a plant monster. So, my assumption is he's probably human, or he could be actually a sheep. Which will probably explain why he didn't remember being human in the first place. So, maybe that could be the reason? I do not know. So now, let us talk to him and deliver a few more items so I can get the next quest story for him. Okay. Give him another one. And one more. Come to think of it, if the climate here had stayed as cold as it was, I would have wilted and died straight away. Correct. A chilling thought. I suppose this floral paradise is my unsuspected savior, as you are. Artorius, thanks to you, I think I have remembered something more of my past. Did you now? I think I remember splitting firewood, and resented that I would do so, as I much preferred tending to the sheep. Yes, yes, you never could tear yourself away from your sweet fluffies, Arden. You've never forget all about your chopping and then had to do it in the middle of the driving snow. You'd be out there shivering and sniffling and muttering such dark words. Y you saw all of that? Ooh. Well, firewood aside, I do remember enjoying a comfortable life here. You see, wolves are in high demand here in Volbarat. Was it? Yes. We're what? That's what this place is called, right? Well, he's right on that department. I was spawn yarn to yarn in a castle town, as the knitting was a rather popular pastime. People were happy to pay a good coin for it. One can never have many pairs of fluffy socks, after all. Speaking of, I remember getting a pair of woolen gloves to a traveler once. Someone who helped me with the errand. An elf. Yes! I knew once of an elf who was rather averse to the gold. And let me guess, it turned into an elf now. With, well, I guess that's an improvement. I change again! Eo 3 <laughs> Elvin Arden. You just look like a huger fellow who used to live at the booksman's shelves. Well, I suppose he wasn't quite so leavy. He's one of your friends, isn't he, Artorius? Yes, he is. Oh, you hinger, was ever so fun to play with. He was quite polite to say everything ill, so we would give to him treats. He lowed and laughed at his sad face while he ate them. What fun we had. But that was just entertaining, Arden. Don't fret. Isn't that supposed to be a good thing? I don't know whether to feel flattered or horrified at the fact. Well then, that was interesting. Arden can also consider a tentative blah blah blah. Okay, new item wears. Yes, I know. Speaking of eating things both lovely and loathsome, have you remembered that you used to eat sheep, Arden? What? How can I have no idea of my obsession with sheep extends so far as to consume them? 
But all things considered, I suppose that makes a certain degree of sense. It might be also explain why I suddenly find myself craving roast meat. Mmm, meat. Regardless, while diet is irrelevant to a leap man, I must have put consideration to my meals as a person. And any guests to that might have to eat it. Uh huh. Satisfaction guaranteed. Yay. Now I need to deliver another about items, which is a classic Volbrick cuisine. And this one requires classic Volbrick ingredients. So I need three of these. Uh, classic Volbrick ingredients. Three of that. Okay. And done. Alright. Last ingredient we needed to turn to Arden. Hello, Atorius! I don't hate to keep troubling you, but I might have some items that the person might eat. Well, how about this classic Volbrite cuisine? Volbrite cuisine my probably features lamb and mutton. But rest assured that sheep cuisine probably features Liebman fawns. What goes around comes around, I suppose. I guess. For me? I can't fully express how gratitude I feel, Taurus. Ooh. Thank you, thank you, and thank you again. Alright, give me more of this late men. Oh, look at that. My white script has cap. Uh, I'm gonna buy something real quick. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. So I decided to spend a couple of my right scripts in the Crystarian because I'm still working on, on my other relic weapons for my other crafters. And make the delivery, yes. And last one. Customer is always right. I truly appreciate your efforts, Atorius. Thank you for bringing me so many helpful reminders. I have a right to offer you a way to recompense, but please feel free to snuggle the sheep or two before you go. It will be both smooth and invigorate you like little else. Um, thank you, Arden. And okay, now I need to wait until next week to continue the quest line for this.